Well, this is just awkward. Um, <laughs> I'm on the train tracks above where I wanted to turn. Oh. And I can't really jump off unless... Oh, no, that's not what I want. Do I have a parachute? No, I don't. If I did, then I would consider jumping off. Because, I mean, you could base jump this. Come on, Franklin's done worse. And, and better. Oh, I'm gonna be just driving up here for the rest of my life, though. Oh. And this little, like, turn off there, that was as the rest of my life. It was, it was very short. But, in this kind of high uh, traffic, oh, and high danger industry that Franklin lives in, who knows, your life could end just like that. Because he is shot at, or he uh, falls over and uh, blows up in his vehicle right here. What? What was that? What is all these things just everywhere today? I want to see what it is, actually. Zoom in. I think that was just like a piece of my fender. Hmm. See, that's what I call a fender bender. Oh no! Coming in hot! <laughs> I hope that they are, appreciate my on-timeness, because I'm going to be here several days in the past and in the future. And I'm just going to be doing a stakeout and not sleeping, or I could just sleep in my vehicle. Let's, let's see. Hey, what's up? Or actually, this just happens right now. I really thought that it was going to do the time hey, thing. How you doing? Man, I was wondering, have you heard from your family? Yeah, sure. No, that's a lie. Franklin, tell, tell him about uh, hey, what you got on the phone. Up, yeah, well... It's not gonna matter, we're all gonna be dead in about a half hour anyway. What's going on, ladies? Hello, Trevor. What kept you? Business, Michael, business. Uh, all right? I'm the CEO of a big international corporation. It's very time consuming. Nothing, of course, you'd understand, being a gentleman of leisure. Uh -huh. You know, you know, Franklin, <laughs> if there's one thing that you're gonna learn from being around us, please just fucking insanity. Then they can't fry you. If you want something done, go to the busy man. This rich fuck is useless. Oh, oh, ho, hold on, man. Could y'all knock this shit off? Oh, look! Fucker. Boys, your boys, it's the feds. Hey, where's the other three? What other, other three? three? We told you to bring along six. This is a six-man job. What? No, he didn't. Dave did? No, Dave didn't. You said you'd do it. Oh that no. Is a frickin lie. Are they gonna have to come with I us? Do not get things wrong. Hey guys, All FIB. Right, great. Then we're out of here. Uh, uh, fuck uh, uh, it. Uh, uh, Let's go. You three can do it alone. And die, fuck you. You do your own dirty work. Hey, I do my dirty work every day, keeping the country safe from scum like you. And you're doing a great job, sir. Hey, you want this job done? Then come with us, huh? Come yeah. on. Come on, Mr. Leisure Wear, Mr. Depressed Accountant. Let's go save America. Who the fuck are we saving it from this time? This is the real deal. My sources are convinced there's a plot in international affairs, you know, the agency, and they're using this facility to make a serious nerve toxin. Ah, <laughs> bullshit. Yeah, which they plan in their mind-blowing insanity to let a major terrorist release on a metropolitan area so they can continue to get funding. So Nothing this must be like the anti stuff. Nothing funding for fighting terrorism more than successful acts of terrorism. <laughs> so, so, all right, so let me get this straight then. No, 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 there is no getting it straight. That's the point. Now we're doing this. You two are on getaway. Fuck off and make it happen. Michael, you're with us. What size flipper you wear? So it's a six-man job doing it with five. And two of them are incompetent because they just don't do anything ever. I just say that, but I mean, I guess, like, maybe they just don't have... Agent Norton. They don't have the shooting field. abilities, that's what I'm trying to the say. The sight of you and neoprene is something we say for our worst enemies. Shut <laughs> up, I'll be fine. And you, get in. You're driving. Go down the Wait, am coast. I driving? The facility's a few clicks south of us. I thought that this was like, uh, Mr. Dave. That he was, like, the one that can barely move. Because, I mean, he's... He's eating a lot of donuts in his uh, spare time Listen with FIB. Me, Steve. No wise cracks, got it? No fucking cliches. We're fighting for the freedom of the people today. Don't lecture me on patriotism. You've been living outside the system too long. Social responsibilities, a joke to you. So maybe I redeem myself, get killed in the process, huh? 
That old bullshit. No one is dying on my watch. Not even the burnout bank robber with temper issues and nothing to live for. <laughs> hero's death is too good for you. You'll die in the ignominy you deserve. Oh, thank God. Fate shall carry me safe through these selfless acts of charity. But I thought he was going to say as well, this like, not the even the guy that's just we like the TV show the guy that's with us. I don't Here know. Goes. Time to dive, dive, dive. I should just like sit here and just let them go. <laughs> just pretend that you were gonna do it, and then like, oh yeah, well, uh, you can do it. No, 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 no. Well, I'll be going down after you guys all run out of air. Then I'll help. Oh, are they like swimming on ahead without me? Oh no, I can't see you guys anymore. I regret everything. Probably shouldn't have just left them behind. Well, I left myself behind through. Oh, what's this? I'm gonna go and grab it. Oh, is this like the just various like nuclear waste? Yeah. Even though it's sometimes with collectibles, I kind of don't want to collect things because. So over the outlet. Townley, you've got the cutter. When we I'm gonna use there, a guide, go then I won't be able to figure it out. Roger that. But seriously though, I have no idea what we're going to be doing for this, because like they... That's probably why, because they didn't explain anything. I'm taking the oxyhydro cutter to the grate. Because they say that they're just like, yeah, this is going to be a six-man job, but that's we're not going to tell anything about it. Three and a half thousand degrees. Yeah, thanks for the science lesson. Can I keep this for the next vault I hit? That gas won't last forever, so cut smart. Oh. Okay, fine, I'll actually uh, not hold it down then. Okay, I thought that that one went, but... You just have to w listen for the weird, like, boom noise. But I just love that. Because so, the way sound goes those through those water... Oh, it's just so beautiful. Well... The way that they do things with uh, torture, I, or maybe they're just doing that for fun, actually. That's what Dominator and uh, Marianne, like that one crazy woman does on their free time. They probably are in a relationship together, it would make so much sense. Now we know the secret has been discovered. They're all together with FIB and have some crazy, crazy parties. Oh boy. But yeah, like... Michael should just put this in his back pocket. I know that this is like that should do it. underwater and all that, and a scuba suit, but just keeps that cutter on him and just make sure that that FIB just never takes it back. Could use this just to weld open a car too, because why not? I like okay. to just weld holes we in vehicles. The tunnel, gain access to the facility. Okay. Oh, is this the the alien lab place? If it is, oh. You sure this thing comes out where you think it does? The intel is good. We're a hundred yards out. Ah, I feel like I'm giving a colonoscopy to the Statue of Happiness. <laughs> nice change from being up Trevor Phillips' ass all day. Uh. You feel that? Water's getting warmer. You wet your pants, Davy? This is a cooling tunnel. Of course it's getting warmer. No one urinated. Uh, I know for a fact that that ain't true. <laughs> oh, Michael. But also, like, if it's getting warmer, I'd be concerned. Like, this, or if, like, those turbines start turning the on. The problem with this job mm. is I only get to know the criminals who are dumb enough to get themselves caught. Yeah, only I wasn't caught, remember? I turned myself in. He makes a point. That makes you doubly dumb. Oh. Well, I think that it makes that uh, guy that does his TV show doubly dumb because he didn't know what was happening. You have to research your uh, criminals if you're going to be doing a TV show about them. I mean, come on, man. You don't know what you're doing. But yeah, I, I think that these turbines are going to turn on and it's going to be like Banjo Tooie all over again. You're going to get sliced into shreds and turn into like bird and bear stew. Okay, let's go up. At least I think that's where we're supposed to be going. There's a ladder there. Get up it. Okay. I thought the ladder was just like completely underwater. 
it's, uh, you know, I, I can't swim up. I, I have problems. I'm sorry, guys. I never learned that one tool. I can swim down. That's easy. But up. How are we? Huh? We ready? I was born ready. Let's do this. Come on, Dave. Oh, so they're going to be doing shooting. Hey, hey, hey. We locate the toxin and action our escape strategy. That's what we got. Great. Lead the way. I think one of them Bank is going to die here. Your job is to keep this covert and non-lethal as long as you can. What about Get this? Wall, quick. Whoa, whoa, whoa! It's time this guy went to sleep, Michael. <laughs> Shot him right in the face. Oh, that probably will uh, take Hemsworth him down. See him. Drop your piece. Yo, who are you? Uh, okay. Somebody that's going to hurt your face a lot. Because, I mean, if you got hit in the face with one of those, like, barb things so that actually, like, stun you... Ah, hoo -hoo. Like. You're on a need-to-know basis, bank robber. Shut it. But I think this is a different kind of stun gun. I don't know. Uh-oh. Don't worry, I got him. Out, out. Ah. Get the pass. <laughs> they said out, but I mean, I, I kept him in the elevator. Up. How you feel about this? I feel pretty damn fine. Yeah, if only your camera crew was here. Eyes right. Stay on top oh, of this. Okay, he's still in the elevator. Let's go. I thought we pulled him out. You see the lab geeks? I don't want trouble from these two. And we're just sneaking in. Don't run. Shush. I got him. Don't worry. I'm gonna hit him in the back. Put him up! Oh! <gasps> Ugh, I gotta recharge. What are you doing oh, here? Oh, I missed. I don't want to die. Ugh. There we go. They're down. Let's go. See. Corridor goes around to the left. Also, what I should have done is just like go and crush his glasses as well. I knock him out and then on, make it so that he can't go. easily call for reinforcements and stuff. It makes sense. So then you're just like, oh man, now I gotta go to my optometrist and get some glasses again. I'm not gonna call any like backup. This is like a really awesome uh, little like mission thing, though. This is them. Take them out or let them go. I dare you. Just a little pinprick. I What's probably should have taken him out. Go on. Yeah, let's go. Clear. We move forward. Because they're gonna notice those bodies on the ground that have hit the floor. Oh no. Swipe us in. Come on. Well, this is still like a really cool mission. It makes me think of like a James Bond thing. Let's do this. Michael definitely is. Access. Uh, Who are you people? The locking mechanism is triggered from the inside. Wait, someone's coming. I got this. Wait, 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 wait. Where? Where's the guy coming from? Um. You! Hands up! Back up! Back up! And freeze! We get collateral! He's he's not freezing. You wanna see his very large brain smeared on the glass? Open up. The special oh, that's agents smart. have the door. Go in there and your nerve agent. Uh, there we go. Also you get down on the ground. <laughs> okay, let's see what there is to see in here. We probably should have used them because they might know more about this than we do. The most dangerous man in the country. I'm also the most shit scared. Oh man. Thank you, federal government. Hmm. But also, I guess like maybe the federal government just doesn't know anything. We need like, to get it into a refrigeration unit. They can't do anything dealing with uh, human, humane. That is human. Ah! I'm gonna die. I'm just straight up gonna die. Yep. That was bad. Uh, Michael died. So, I guess that the other guys didn't die, like the guys that didn't, did, they don't know how to use guns. Even though if you're with FIB, they probably should know. They're just retired or something. They're just having their cushy jobs and whatnot. I'm still gonna use this to start off with. I'm gonna stun one guy and then just like... Oh, I have a brilliant idea. This is what I do. Ah! Oh, bam! I'm non-lethal to the max. Oh no. I think now might be the time to go loud. Even though this is suppressed, but... I'll show you suppressed! Oh! Oh no. Also, this one guy that's behind me, just... I'm gonna turn off my flashlight just because. But... He's just like hiding. Just like using me as like body armor, basically. Oh no. Oh! 
I'm gonna die still. Oh well, I'm putting my flashlight back on. Uh, you guys go first. Um, I, I'm kind of in pain. And I'm gonna slow-mo. Oh, Slow-mo roll. I'm just like the Matrix, but better. Yes, I am the Matrix. Oh, boy. Oh. I'm surprised it hasn't actually, like, come undone yet. So I've, uh, I've been shot a lot. Also, of all the people that, uh, just, like, could've came on, like, the scuba diving portion, it probably should've been, like, the three, like, Michael, Franklin, and Trevor. And then, like, these other guys can do, like, the getaway, so, you know... Michael, Franklin, and Trevor, they already know how to shoot. They're, that's what they do. They're all about killing. Even though, I guess these guys know what to do, like, where to go. Don't worry, I'll get him out. Or... Oh, you can actually kill him. Okay, this is just like, uh, Call of Duty or something. Okay. I'm gonna pull out a shotgun for this last bit. Because... Shotguns... Close quarters. Oh. Oh! Um... I'm gonna get shot at, please! There we go. Oh, is that supposed to be a euphemism for something, or what? Oh boy! Ugh. Um... Hmm... I think it's grenade time. Time to really go loud! Oh no! Oh! Well... That's gonna work pretty well. Oh, don't go up! Not yet! Uh -huh. Well... Wait, is, I guess that probably is a quote from this game. For some reason, I always thought that, that was like something else, maybe, but... <laughs> oh! Oh, the fire! Call the fire department, because you're getting roasted, and so on. Oh no, I need to actually... Do I have... I don't have Molotovs. That's what I wanted to do now, just like firebomb it up. Or maybe stickies. Oh! Kaboom! I always forget which direction it is. Because in GTA 4 it's down, in this one it's like... Left. Ah, oh, come on. Just have some continuity. Okay. Gotta do it before the time has run out. We're going to all die. Neurotoxins. Engaged. Ah, right, here we go. Okay. Or before uh, Blood Dragon, you know those those big dragons come out of nowhere. This music's exactly like Blood Dragon. I'm just a couple clicks out. The package ready. Oh, that's why they needed to Trevor. Package is ready. Get over here, man. I thought we were just gonna have a driver to get out. And anybody can drive. I'm gonna drop the hook down already. If I can. Drop the hook! Okay, maybe I can't. Whatever. But this is totally the alien base. That's what I thought it would be. Don't trust the aliens. They're gonna be building, a, like, dangerous neurotoxins that are gonna kill us all. And then there's gonna be the guys from Destroy All Humans and so on. Agency response teams are already in the building! It's never too late! We're going! Let's go! It's too risky, Bandito! That bird goes down and takes half the West Coast with it! You know what? If you're done puking up excuses, how about we come up with a solution? Okay, okay! Alright, uh, you go off the in cover! Fuck it, fine by me! And the dead bodies? I'm lucky I'm not one of them! Come on! Let's go! Hmm. Ah! Wait, what? <laughs> Oh. oh my me, special agent, I got this covered! Detain this man! Fuck you, I should detain you, I just took a bullet from my country! Time to oh. He's going to get completely taken down. But... I guess that was sort of a smart idea in a way, because now he's gonna bide us time. Because they're just like, oh, we're gonna detain you. And that takes time. Only self-inflicted ones! 
fucking guy shot himself so he could pass as a double agent. Uh, well, maybe they'll debrief him with a 12-inch aluminum flashlight. Ain't oh. the easy way out. We're the ones hoping we'll outrun the agency response team. I think Franklin's the one taking the easy way. Guy's got his feet up in an aircraft hangar. Look, let's just yeah. get to the airport so we can finish this bullshit. See, exactly, like us, Franklin. I'll take the nerve agent. Mr. Phillips, can I trust you to dispose of the chopper? I got more important things to worry about messing around with this stupid chopper. He's going to keep this like chopper. He totally is. Means something. Not made up wars, but made up enemies. Matters of the heart. Is he fucking with me? Probably not. <laughs> awesome. This basically means that we get, like, a cargo bob now. Even though this isn't a complete, like, this is a different kind of cargo bob. It's weird. But, yeah, like, if Franklin is just sitting around doing nothing, then they basically could have switched roles as long as one person knew how to fly from the FIB guys. But I don't know, I think he's, he made a good enough distraction. Oh, okay, I probably should put it on the truck. Um, let's try to get this proper, trim and proper, the truck's, uh, there we go. Oh, there's just a cutscene. I didn't even need to try. Come on. I'm using all this skill. Oh, I think maybe... Hmm. I'm feeling that Franklin's now gonna have to drive the truck away, right? Hey, Frank. It's cracking, man. So the chemical weapon in there, right? If it even is a chemical weapon, hell, it could be shaving cream for all I know. By the way, next time you're getting wet. Oh, but there won't be a next time, will there, Davey? There never is. I'll do my best for you. I always try. Yeah, well, maybe this time we'll get lucky. Maybe this time Steve will succumb to the strains of enhanced interrogation techniques. Interrogate oh, no. him? Are you insane? They're probably decorating him right now. Hey, Davey, your boys at the agency are on to you, remember? Ah, huh? you and Stevie. Just try and keep your heads down. Yeah, putz. No, they probably are going to be doing that. Because they always have to be doing their rough interrogations oh, and yes. tortures. What's up, man? My days in the wilderness are over. Lester, he settled up with that crazy Mexican motherfucker. Gave him the artifact. <laughs> now, as long as Trevor handles the wife, we're good. But what about him, man? Yeah, fuck him. He likes the desert. Besides, we do one big score, we're all gonna have to go our own separate ways anyway. Oh, man. I can't wait to get back to that movie studio. <laughs> Yo, yeah, well, all right, man. Well, shit, I'll holler at you later. He can have right? a movie about what his life. Show. I'll tell you what. You could take this desert and stick it. My life may be a world of pain, but from here on out, it's going to be cool, comfortable, air-conditioned pain. <laughs> yeah, well, take I mean, he does have a bullet in his collarbone right now, and also in his crotch. Ow. So, oh, I can still move him slightly, <laughs> make him look really awkward standing there in his wetsuit, just like, oh, what's going on? Oh. We're gonna switch over to Trevor. Just flying around in his chopper mobile. Oh! I had a wonderful time, Trevor. But we both know I made a vow to my husband. Okay. I have a feeling this song was meant to be on. You have a great pain inside you, but you are a beautiful man. I've never been so happy and so sad. <laughs> but I, yep, this song was meant to be on. You have a beautiful way with words. <laughs> for, 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 some, for some reason, everyone I love abandons me. I am not abandoning you. I am going home. <laughs> Street you! I know. No. Oh, man. <laughs> this is too perfect. The references and so on. Oh, man. I just love that this just automatically went into this. There's no words that it can describe still. It's not- I don't have any sadness. I'm just so happy. <laughs> oh, man. That and also we have uh, a newfound friend, which is a sign from the side of the road. But I have a feeling that Martin Madrose is still going to be very, uh, upset, to say the least. I don't know. But at the same time, at least 
he's gotten everything back that he wanted. He gets his wife back, he gets a present as well from the artifact. So, he's coming out on top on this. <sighs> No. Stay. You better treat her right, man! I will, amigo! Yeah, otherwise... The other ear! Of course! <laughs> the way I see things, you and me and Michael, we're, we're friends now. Good friends! He's actually afraid of Such Trevor. good friends that we will make a great effort to avoid one another. That's fucking perfect. Uh, thank Michael for this statue. It is exquisite. Yeah. Yeah, I will. <laughs> oh, man. I have to leave this area. Uh, I got a checkpoint, yeah. Headshots. Stunner. Oh, I needed to stun one more person. It's probably because I, I knocked out a couple guys. I like to punch people, okay? I, I have issues. But, oh man. I just... This is all way too perfect. But, who knew that, like, Martin Madroza, like, he is a crazy guy, but... Even he can uh, be afraid of Trevor. Which, I wouldn't doubt him. Oh man.